a Speaker's Corner follow-up. A couple of months back, we told you about big problems rolling out a brand new truck inspection system here in Ontario. So we decided to revisit the story to see how it's going now. Okay, perfect. In July, when we last spoke to Steve Shipton, who runs a large-scale truck inspection and repair shop in Pickering, he was worried. Well, a lot of people are concerned. They're asking what's happening. Back then, he was weeks away from a deadline to take part in Ontario's Drive On program, a big change in the way he does inspections on heavy-duty diesel vehicles. But he and several other shops had yet to receive the computer tablets needed to perform those tests. Yeah, we need the government-issued iPad. Fast forward to today. Since uh, we last spoke, we did receive the government uh, tablets, and uh, after a little bit of growing pains and adjustment, the system works quite well. With the new tablets, mechanics upload the entire inspection process, ensuring those big rig trucks you share the road with are safe to go. Basically, we do the same inspection as before using uh, National Code 11B. But now we're documenting and there's pictures to go with it. Auditors at a U.S.-based company hired by the Ministry of Transportation review the uploaded inspection files and only after approval can mechanics print a yellow passing sticker with a QR code. And here's the OBD connector. Okay. So okay. this connects to the vehicle? Or? Correct. Okay. This will connect to the vehicle to, to run a test on it, to, uh, to check the different systems, verify the VIN, verify the mileage. Okay. So there's no... It's almost next to impossible now to, to duplicate or counterfeit one of these safety inspections. Which was happening under the previous system where some mechanics could print the stickers without proper inspections or oversight. It's going to be very difficult for someone to, uh, to copy these, these new uh, stickers because they're actually printed right on site using special paper and uh, you know with a QR code. Codes MTO officers can now scan on the highway to ensure a proper inspection was done, but it's still not without complaints. The process does take more time and costs trucking companies more money for yearly inspections. A cost, Shipton says, at the end, is worth it for everyone on the road. For public safety, number one, it's going to take a lot of junk off the road. Um, you know, the, everyone's on the same page now, um, whether they want to be or not. As always, if you have an issue, story, or question you'd like us to look into, reach out by visiting the Speaker's Corner tab on the City News website. Pat Taney, City News.